In this video, we will solve an age problem where we're given the sum of the ages right now. This tweaks things slightly from our typical table, which has the names, the now, and the change. We're told the sum of the ages of Nicole and Kristen is 32. Let's fill in the names right now, Nicole and Kristen. In two years, Nicole will be three times as old as Kristen. How old are they now? Well, we can see that we're talking about a change of in two years, so we're going to add two to get the last column. But the tricky part might be filling in the now. Let's think about the now. If they have a sum of 32, and Kristen was 10, or Nicole was 10, sorry, what would Kristen's age have to be so that the sum was 32? It would have to be 22, which we get by taking the total 32 minus the 10, which is Nicole's age now. Notice we took the total and subtracted the first person's age to get the second person's age. We're going to follow that same pattern. The sum of their ages is 32 right now. We don't know Nicole's age. Kristen, then, must be the total minus the first person. Notice when we do this, if we were to combine now and Kristen together, combining like terms, the x's would subtract out to 0, and we would have a total age of 32. We're now ready to continue like we would any other age problem. A change of two years in the future means we're adding 2 to Nicole, x plus 2, and adding 2 to Kristen. 32 plus 2 is 34, and we're still subtracting x. Now we're ready to make an equation about what happens in two years. In two years, Nicole will be three times as old as Kristen. Nicole, in will be form of to be or is equals 3 times 3 times Kristen. Again, we make this equation without worrying about the time change or the table, because we're going to marry the table and the equation at this point by replacing the n with what n is in the future, x plus 2 equals 3k, and k in the future is 34 minus x. We now have an equation we can quickly solve by distributing the 3. x plus 2 equals 102 minus 3x. Move the variable to the same side by adding 3x. 4x plus 2 equals 102. Subtract 2 from both sides. 4x equals 100. And finally, we finish by dividing both sides by 4. x, we find out, is 25. Looking at our table, we see x represents Nicole's age. Nicole is 25. Kristen's age, we see, is 32 minus x. 32 minus 25 is 7. Nicole is 25, and Kristen is 7. The sum of their ages is 32, and in two years, Nicole will be three times as old as Kristen. When we're given the sum right now as 32, well, we don't know the first person. The second person is the total minus the first, 32 minus x.